Washington, CNN House Speaker Paul Ryan deleted a tweet Saturday touting the GOP tax overhaul after critics called him out for appearing out of touch with the reality of low-income individuals' financial situations. The tweet shared the story of a secretary who, according to a report by the Associated Press, was pleasantly surprised her pay went up $1.50 a week. A secretary at a public high school in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, said she was pleasantly surprised her pay went up $1.50 a week. She said, that, will more than cover her Costco membership for the year. Ryan tweeted with a link to the full article, a basic Costco membership costs $60 a year. People, including several prominent Democrats, noted on social media that $1.50 per week is not a significant pay bump. Paul Ryan deleted his embarrassing tweet of the blatant admission because he and Republicans don't want you to know the truth. The hashtag Optax scam is a gift to corporate America and the top 1% at your expense, Rep. Nancy Pelosi, Democrat California, tweeted. He also doesn't want you to know he got $500.000 from the Koch family. John Favreau, a former Obama staffer, tweeted, as a thank you for passing a $1 trillion corporate tax cut. Paul Ryan received $500,000 in campaign contributions from the Koch brothers, which would probably cover the cost of buying a Costco. Remember, if you don't think benefits like an extra $1.50 a week and free hostess snacks are good enough, you're the one who's out of touch, he added. Rep. Keith Ellison, Democrat Minnesota, also tweeted a link to the since-deleted Ryan tweet, writing, Wells Fargo fresh off of defrauding millions of Americans, gets $3.4 billion. California Lt. Gov. Gavin Newsom tweeted with a screenshot of Ryan's tweet, Guess someone told Paul Ryan you shouldn't go around praising yourself for giving a working person an extra $1.50 a week, because he deleted this tweet. Ryan's office did not immediately return CNN's request for comment. Ryan's challenger also took the opportunity to fundraise off the club. Randy Bryce, the Democrat running to unseat Ryan in Wisconsin, tweeted, moments ago, at Ryan deleted this tweet after we told him just how out of touch he was. Show Paul Ryan what you think of his tax bill. Chip in $1.50 now to help us repeal and replace Ryan permanently this November. Republicans passed a major tax overhaul in December, which was considered one of Ryan's primary focuses in